Hello, this is Skywarp's Hanger, and today we have Velma and the Ghost. This is from the Series 2 of the Scooby-Doo uh, figures by Character um, LTD. They come in a box, which, that's pretty cool. These run about $7 at Walmart, so uh, getting them in a box, that's pretty nice. Uh, as you can see, it says Series 2 up here. Um, you get some artwork on the side, which is pretty nifty. You get some artwork on the other side, and on the top, you get that Scooby Doo in yeah, series two. Oh, I knocked them over! And then on the bottom, you get some writing, and on the back, you get some cool artwork, which that's pretty nifty. And if you want to read the box there you go you can pause it now one thing i noticed on the box it shows uh the ghost having a mouth and on the figure there's no mouth uh these are the other series two figures you can collect um i passed on this one because i really wasn't that impressed with it um usually i nab up all the villains but i wasn't really big on the fright face scooby because i already have him and uh, the zombie I wasn't impressed with and Daphne and the witch doctor we already have so uh, I didn't bother with that one either but on to the figures um, as I mentioned before uh, you notice there's no mouth on here where there is on the box which that doesn't bother me too much because he's still pretty cool and this is really what I bought the set for. I paid $7 for this ghost. I'm just realizing that now. Hmm. It is a statue. It really is. It's, it's pretty much a statue. But it, it's going to look good in the display area. Oh no, if I could stop knocking things down, it'll look great in the display. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much just the statue. No articulation whatsoever. But it's really cool. I like it. And, yeah. So you can see how it measures up with the different characters. Yeah, pretty cool. Um, yeah, we got my ruler. <laughs> Ugh, let's see how tall he is. He stands at approximately five and three-eighths inches tall. Daphne stands at four inches so there's your sizing up as i said he has no articulation so we really don't need to go into that the only pain apps he has is the eyeballs other than that it's just a piece of hard plastic with some uh cloth molding in it even still i like it i think it's really cool um velma velma's pretty cool uh she can turn her head uh, she does have the 360 wind-up pitch. Her elbow goes up less than a 90. Um, her leg can move that far forward and that far back. She does have knee articulation, which goes up to about a 90. Which is pretty cool. Uh, she still didn't come with an accessory for her hand. I don't know why she has that holding hand. But, hey... Maybe they have that plan for a later line so you can buy another one. This is still my favorite Velma. It looks accurate to what I know as Velma, so... Yeah. There's your comparison if you wanted to compare the two. And that is pretty much our review. And if you like our review, please click like. And please subscribe to our page to see more reviews from us. Thank you.